Queen Mary Operator to auction lease for ship. Today we have an update. Eagle Hospitality Trust is getting set to auction off the Queen Mary and its properties. But before we step aboard, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for future updates. Thank you. In March, an announcement by Singapore-based Eagle Hospitality Trust said it will sell 15 of the 18 hotels in its portfolio, including the Queen Mary, Sheraton Pasadena, and Holiday Inn Anaheim, for a starting price of $470 million in an auction set tentatively for May 20th. The city of Long Beach owns the Queen Mary, but for decades has leased the ship to various operators, some who have met similar financial struggles. Eagle hopes to sell the Queen Mary lease individually to someone who recognizes the opportunities for development. Eagle has received an initial bid for the entire portfolio from a private investment firm called Monarch Alternative Capital. However, Eagle could choose to sell the Queen Mary or any of its properties individually in the auction, adding that it has received multiple offers for the Long Beach landmark. Stating the following, the Queen Mary is a special asset that has tremendous redevelopment opportunity on the 45 acres of waterfront. It's a world-renowned asset, and we hope that the next custodian can allow it to reach its full potential. Meanwhile, the lease of the Queen Mary will change hands yet again, as one of the biggest concerns remains the repairs and maintenance for the aging vessel. Eagle Hospitality filed for bankruptcy with a total of more than $500 million in debt on January 18th as the COVID-19 pandemic has ravaged the hospitality industry. But the company showed signs of problems in 2019 before the pandemic, including a $341 million default on a loan from Bank of America. Once again, Long Beach has a history of operators who have struggled to make the ship profitable. Any thoughts or insights that you would like to share? Please do 